welcome back to an episode of the UHC 404 challenge or the UHC season 7 map uh, done as a 404 challenge um, so <laughs> you guys missed some stuff I uh, recorded three episodes and Mike was muted so <laughs> um, I just uh, mentioned it to uh, the guys I was like well I got an hour and a half of footage here um, and there's no sound, so if you guys want, you can throw it on the podcast as a background. <laughs> Something going on in the background. Um, but uh, you'll be happy to know I didn't die, at least. At least there was no footage of me dying. Um, but uh still have it. There's just no audio. There, there's, there's game sounds. There's no, there's no me talking. There was lots of me talking. Talking to nobody. Ah. <sighs> So I've done quite a bit, actually. Got quite a bit accomplished. Um, you'll be glad to know. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I've made made more buckets, as you can see. Um, I did quite a bit of uh, quite a bit of caving. <laughs> and imagine that. Uh, let's see here. Um, I made a chicken farm. I moved the the chickens that we have over here out. Um, again, hopefully, hopefully on the next podcast, you guys can see all that. I'll, if I can get them uh, to to throw it as the background for and just have it, you know, just play, because I really don't know what else to do with it. If not, um, I've I've tried to do post commentary before, and it's just it's really no fun um, for anybody. So I uh, prefer not to. I'm a live commentary kind of guy. Um, but yeah, I made a chicken farm, found some slime, as you can see. It's the weekend, so I try to try to record a bunch on the weekends. I made a new wheat farm. I'm gonna show you all that in just a second. Let's see here. Get all this stuff in here. Uh, been killing lots of skeletons. You can see I'm level 18 now. I don't know what I was the last time we were together, um, but I've been very busy. I got these mumps over here to shut up. Um, that was a whole episode in itself because I got lost quite a bit trying to find my way over to there. Um, what else has happened? It's been so so busy. So busy in these last three episodes. I got a lot accomplished, and I'm really sad that, uh, that there's no audio. It's in fact I didn't realize it until I was ending the last episode, and I had to sneeze, and I went to mute my mic, and the the button was already pressed. <laughs> it's like, oh no! And I knew, I knew it was too late. There wasn't anything that could be done. I was like, maybe, maybe I just muted it. Maybe there's just one or two episodes that are missing audio, but nope. Uh, so yeah, what are you gonna do? I still got coal in my pocket here. I made a bunch of sticks. You guys missed that too. <laughs> uh, the things you've missed. If you wonder why I have fences on me, I use those as windows for the chicken farm. Um, which again, I will show you here in just a second. Let's put this coal in there. Uh, let's go ahead and make another. Put this. Actually, this doesn't go in this chest. Just this chest. Um, go ahead and make so gonna make I just got a steam announcement that uh the summer sale um, winner was announced not winner oh telephone be right back <coughs> all right I'm back apologize missed my workbench there all right. Anyways, make another pick. I've realized that I kind of go through two picks an episode, um, which is okay because I'm getting getting enough iron to sustain that. I believe, um, hopefully at least, I made three new buckets. I think I already said that. Let's put that up. Let's make these into jack o' lanterns. And put the extra in here. Alrighty, let's move on for the day show you guys what all I've been doing while you've been gone um, <laughs> uh, three episodes down the train so I was gonna make the chicken farm right here um, but I ended up deciding not to because I didn't think I was gonna be tall enough so I ended up making it over here as you can see we got a wheat farm here too there's the chickens I'm um, gonna use those fences to uh, Guess some mob stepped right there, or jumped right there. All right. 
I haven't been breeding the chickens. I've just been letting them uh, poop eggs, as we can just hear right now as I say it. And I've stopped putting wheat there because it just falls into the lava. <laughs> um, these are all things that we've learned in previous episodes while no one was speaking to you. <laughs> uh, you may get to see it. Uh, in fact, I see a message on Skype right now that may be them saying yay or nay to my idea of throwing it in there. Um, okay. In fact, let's see real quick. It was just Badge laughing at me. Alright, so let's uh, take a look at the tree, the chicken farm here. Oh, yep, look at that. Glorious. They're very happy chickens. Nice guys. The kind of chickens any man could get behind. <laughs> get behind. Um, so, a goal that I've had for the last couple episodes is I want to get rid of all the water. Um, actually, before we get off here, I need to fill up my lava buckets. Um, so I took out this lava that was back in here for the most part. There's still a little bit left. I don't know if I can reach it. Looks like I can. Um, I got worried that I was going to fall down in here from up there. So I uh, kind of came in here and put down this cobble here. Anymore. Yeah, I feel really bad about you guys missing out. Um, quite a few good little moments. You know, every episode has a little moment or two. Uh, but there was several near-death experiences. Um, I, I looked an Enderman. That was great fun. Uh, anytime you look an Enderman, really changes your life. Okay. All right. Let's see, I was working through here some actually. There's a big open area somewhere. I think it's near here. Let's put some lava right here, actually. Um, kind of could use some like right in here too. I keep having mobs right in here, and I've been trying my best to get it lit up to where that won't be the case. I'm sure, like, right here is probably too dark. In fact, okay. Alright, so up here is kind of the area I've been working on the most. Um, somewhere. This is not it. This is not the place I speak of. Shit, I, don't, I keep getting lost, too. That's <laughs> something that I've been dealing with in my life. Where's this area at that I was working on? Oh yeah, okay, this links to it here. Um, somewhere. Somewhere. Oh, there was diamond right there that we'd been missing. Okay, where the fuck? Oh, there's always this goddamn skeleton right there. I've had so much of it, but I've had enough. Ah! Don't you... Son of a fucking goddamn it. Dude, this guy. He's gonna kill me. <sighs> this is not the area that I was trying to talk about. Look at that gold over there. Um, I got quite a bit of gold last episode, actually. Um, I think they're... That's what I was talking about. In fact, under that diamond right there was gold. Um... Where is this area? <laughs> Flaming creeper alert. Here we go, here we go. This is it. Yes, here's the big area. I've been I've gotten rid of like three or four water sources that come into here. And um I've been trying to kind of work my way up. 
but what I've learned is that there's a lot more mobs nowadays now that I've you know kind of blocked up some of these areas oh you son of a bitch got rid of my jack-o-lantern too ruining my life um yeah that's my main goal in life right now is to get rid of all these water sources man I just want them gone uh, they're bringing mobs down. They're they're trapping mobs in corners. They're making splishy splashy sounds. It's just I've had enough. I've had enough of all the mobs and all the corners. Good God! At all the mobs and all the corners. Oh, and I killed some chickens um, before I made the chicken farm, and uh, that's where I have the chicken that I'm currently eating from. Whoops. Right. And I just don't know where to go, man. There's just it's it's one of those things. It's kind of like a I don't know. Whenever you. Uh, you don't clean for a week or so, and you, whenever you do go to clean, it's just it's like where do you begin to get all the mess taken care of? You get a little overwhelmed feeling. Feeling. That's, that's how I feel about this cave right now. I feel like it's just a mess, and I don't know where to begin to get it clean. <laughs> I made an attempt to go up one of these really tall waterfalls. And almost fell and died. Okay. All right. So, hey, how goes it? I think the one. These fucking skeletons, man. I might should look at my armor. I feel like I've taken a beating recently. Oh, still alright, I guess. Alright, let's um let's go up this waterfall here. Okay, there's no water there. That's the thing, man. You go up these things and then it just goes up some more and some more, and then eventually you find the top. And you feel like you've conquered the world. Okay, this is one of the ones that may go all the way to the surface, it looks like. Well, apparently it's raining out there. Okay, we got a lava fall here, too. Oh, it looks like that's the surface, in fact. Oh, yeah, that is the surface. Nervous about going up anymore. <laughs> Grab this right here, real quick. See, so I don't know if this is coming from the surface or what. Obviously, I can't go to the surface. Um, oh, look at that. There's some sand. I do want the sand. Okay, it looks like this is coming from the surface. Was able to get rid of it. Perfect. Um, looks like there's more right there. Grab the sand. Fucking shit, dude. Two pieces of sand. I like sand. sand here. Too bad there's not some reeds to like fall down in this hole with me. <laughs> Could use some reeds too. Let's 
Looks like I've gotten rid of that water completely now. Water here, or else I'm gonna be stuck right up there. I'm not gonna go all the way down though, I have to work my way back down now. Um, so I know it's gonna be a question of can you look at the surface? You can't, you just can't take your feet up there, it's really the main thing. You can, you're allowed to look up, you know, through a hole that's been made by the world. You just can't, uh, just can't go up there on your own, you know. Um, but with that said, I wonder, I wonder if if we're anywhere near where B double O and I came down at. Since that's one of our goals of things to accomplish. Luckily, I didn't uh, I didn't do any of those type of things in the last uh, three episodes. So you guys aren't gonna miss out on any of that stuff. I was about to jump up through there. Damn idiot. I figure now's a good time to, uh... Since I'm so high up here, I can get rid of some of this water that's trickling down. And I'm so far away from, uh, taking baby steps through the cave right now. Because I just kind of swam up, you know? <laughs> it wasn't really my intention. But that's what happened. Looks like that water river there is one of the ones that I probably should get rid of. Looks like it goes down quite a ways. Just want to grab this iron wall up here because I don't know when I'll be back up here, you know? Okay, this one right here is another one that goes way down, looks like. Let's see where this originates. Oh, right here is the, is the surface for real. Okay, so I just need to block up this whole hole right here and not swim out there. see what I'm placing blocks on. I'm just placing them. There we go. I've got some more sand here. That I will definitely take. This creeper in the hole here. Okay, this water doesn't go all the way down. Just goes down to a creeper. So I guess I could have left this water alone. It wasn't the kind of water that's pissing me off right now in the game. single hole, right? Yeah. I kind of hate to put lava in here. Oh no, I guess it is going. It is going somewhere here. I think I'm just going to stick a jack lantern in this hole right here. I don't know if that water was flowing down there or not, but whatever. <clears throat> it's been taken care of now either way. I guess if I can't find my way back down, I can live in this little area for a little while until I do find my way back down. It's always raining in this game. Always raining. Okay. This is definitely the kind of lava I want to get rid of. Or lava. Uh, water I want to get rid of right here. I think, actually, I think this is where we entered the cave at to begin with, to be honest with you. Almost positive it is. Okay, I can't see anything now. Did that do it? Is the water coming down? Yes, it is. Okay. Could not tell. sure that that hole right there would kill me. Again, it might be tough for me to get down now. 
I don't know for sure. But we're gonna figure our way back down somehow. We'll watch it go spun around. Like even though it's such a massive cave, I think I've lit up enough downstairs that I could find my way back home once I get down no matter what, eventually. There's only so many different directions you can go, I guess. But I'm feeling good about the amount of water I'm getting rid of right now because I'm just, I've had so, just had enough, man. Just had enough. I'm almost feeling like I, maybe I should go down with one of these waters. up some of my stuff that really sucks son of a bitch dude that pisses me right off looks like uh, things are busy spawning while I was out of town of course you're gonna get one more hit off before I kill you, you bastard Definitely a slime spawning area here. Or was that a creeper? Bastard. Okay. Looks like I've gotten rid of quite a bit of water this time. Like for real. Yeah, that was that was a lot of water. Man, that shit must have plinkoed its way down here. Cause like I swear more water than I thought I was going to get rid of is gone now. Alright, that makes me feel really happy. Let's go ahead and get these buckets of lava down here. Okay, there's still water over here. Uh, let's... I guess the only problem with lava light like this is if water does touch it, it's it's gone. Um, whereas the wall, the source block is up high, so the most you're going to do is get some cobble out of it. I don't really know what I should do with the, uh, the, gla or the sand that I just got. I don't know if I should... Bang. What should I get? 31. That's a lot more than I thought I got, actually. I mean, I guess the obvious answer is to make to make glass out of it. Um, I mean, it's really that's all you can do with sand, anyways. So unless you're gonna make some sandstone, which I don't think would be be very smart. But uh, I mean, I don't really need glass for anything. Should I make? Uh, let's say I guess I can make uh, <laughs> bottles, but I can't. I have to go to the Nether to get potions. I could still go to the Nether, I guess, but not go for the glowstone and stuff. That's really all I want to avoid from the nether. I don't want to use glowstone. I feel like it makes it all just too easy. And netherrack especially. Even more so than glowstone, netherrack. I mean, glowstone, you got a chance of dying while you're gathering. I've died plenty of times in my day gathering uh, glowstone. But uh, netherrack, that's just, that's that really is too easy. Alright, here we go. Back around here. I feel like we need some lava right here. Okay. Sure, we've had plenty of chicken poop while I've been going. For sure. I wonder if I should kill any of these guys. Let's go look and see how many it looks like we have. I guess what I could do is 
just leave those guys in there and then throw the eggs somewhere else and then kill the other ones I don't know guess I'm probably overthinking it a little Like I, when I made the new chicken farm, I, this is something that was silenced by a muted mic, um, I decided what I was going to do is leave two chickens in the house just in case something happened to these guys out here, creeper explosion, you know, I mean, you never know, um, there's no telling what could happen. So I think, I think that's what I'm going to do for sure, is leave these two guys in the house alone. at least leave two in here at all times but I wonder if I should uh, breed them in here to be eaten or something I don't know man it's hard to say I can't grab that cuz I could breed these guys now I think I will I'm gonna breed them so often I can kill those and cook them up I guess. Let's throw this egg over here too and see if we get anything out of it. <gasps> wow, I was so lucky. Oh yeah, I guess you guys got to see that either. I threw uh, three stacks of freaking uh, eggs in that other room, the other chicken farm, and I got like four chickens total. I don't know how I got so lucky when I first came down here. But again, I guess I didn't really need to get that lucky. I mean, it's cool to have chickens to eat, but I could have ate wheat. And as far as uh, arrows go, I haven't used any, I don't think, or it's very, very few. I've probably used maybe ten, so I would have been fine. I'm pretty sure. Um, let's see here. I got, I got a lot of stuff now. Uh, as far as like iron goes, I'm fine. I don't think I have to worry about wasting iron. I got thir these 13 diamonds here. I just don't know what to do with. I don't know if I should make something out of them or keep holding on. I just don't know, man. Um, hell, I could eat zombie flesh and live, to be honest. It might be more interesting to do just because it wouldn't keep you full that long. Uh, plenty of bones. Let's see. How many, how many pieces of gold do I have now? 41. I was just curious. Because I keep thinking, you know, will I get enough gold to have technically brought two people back up to full to full life or not? Oh, I know I had these eggs in here. Go ahead and throw these two. Jeez, look at the, look at the lucky guy I am. Get in there. Jeez! Okay. is in my favor at the moment, man. <clears throat> Level 19. That's crazy. Um, all from just killing these mobs. Uh, let's see. Stack of arrows. That up. I don't know what to do with the sand jet. I'm just going to hold on to it for right now until I need some glass or something. I, I haven't really decided where I want to go with that yet. I we'll have, have to think about it. Um, well, I think it's about it for today. Appreciate you guys watching as always, and I'll see you all next time.